All right, guys, we're uh, bringing the old Stanley booster out there. The Fat Max Stanley bought it a couple of years back. Max 1001. So, so, anyway, let's try it again, guys. It's been a year since I, I did that, and we're going to see what if it'll start this time or not. Come on, guys, let's go see. Come on, Spot. Come on, Spot. Come on, Spot. Come on with us. You can go check it out, too. All right, guys, let's see if uh, we can get this old Ford 3000 diesel started up this year. I haven't had it started since about a year ago. It's just sat here on the garden waiting for me to, uh, waiting for me to, to get it going again. It's, uh, it's about the third week or last week in February. And it won't be long that we need to put something in the ground. We're just going to get this thing started in regardless to make sure we got it, getting it ready to go. So I got the old Fat Max out today. And I'm going to check this, check this battery. See how much power we got in this battery. In all fairness, I did put my solar, small solar charger on there. It's about a one amp. It's not very much. Let it say it. And uh, let's see how much power we got in it, guys. So, I'm going to be fair with, with it. I'll let you guys know uh, where we're at. So we'll turn this thing on a, set that one on 20 volts. So she's got 12.3, jumping up and down, it's about 12.6 is the highest it got, 12.6 volts. So I'm not even going to try it just yet, I want to jump it first because it takes a lot of amperage to start this thing and I want to make sure I turning rather quick and I'm sure I need to replace that battery it's you know it's been in there about six years or so it's one of these big tractor batteries and I've been dragging my feet on it because those things are quite expensive so uh, I'm just trying to get the miles out of it or the years out of it before I replace it but we're gonna try it. Uh, with our Fat Max, we're going to plug our, our Fat Max in, guys, our Stanley Fat Max. So there's what it looks like. Stanley Fat Max. It's a thousand peak, a thousand amps. We'll set it up here. There's one thing I don't like about these boosters. The cables, the battery cables are rather short. That's probably, I don't know, that's less than two feet. It may be two feet to the tip of that thing. But it doesn't give you much of a, much of a reach on those cables. But I have a cap over here on my exhaust. I don't know if you can see that or not with the way the camera's facing. But that exhaust, I always want to cover it up with something where it won't rain in. And also, guys, I know you may frown on this, but I put a little bit of engine starting fluid in it. Just give it that little bit of extra on. Just about that much. I do that quite a bit, and I never have had a problem with it. So we'll turn this starter on, this jumper, Stanley Fat Max on it. So we've got a battery status button, and it's got 12.7 volts on it right now. And then we got a, uh, a switch here that you got to turn it on if you want to jump it. And so we're ready to roll, guys. See what she'll do.
probably got a battery cable probably dirty but I'll have to take those off and uh, work on those all right guys 12.02 volts got her hooked up on it showing right now on the old battery so uh, we're gonna try it with this Schumacher I don't know if it's gonna start or not we just let me see I'm trying to Try to get you in here. All right. So let's see what it'll do. A little starting in it. Like I said, that Schumacher's got 1,200 cranking amps versus a 1,000 cranking amps that the uh, Fat Max has on it. So we're going to see if this does any better. All right, wait a minute, let's see. That's without anything. Hundred percent charge on the Schumacher. Schumacher. So the directions say to hook up your your leads first and then plug your box in. When it clicks, it's ready to start. Kind of hard with this. You you gotta get there and you gotta get to it and you gotta start it before it clicks. All right. So the red light's on. I hook it up in this little Uh, it's, it's, it's clicking. Uh oh. So unhook it. So it did turn it over, it just didn't start. You have to let it sit to reset what it is. Okay, got the little red button on, a little red light. Then we'll plug it in if I can. It's kind of difficult to plug in. All right, the light's coming on, it's clicking. So that <laughs> I'm gonna get back guys where you can hear me. So you hear, you hear how well it turned over with that Schumacher.
It's not showing anything now. I don't know, guys. It's probably dead. But that's what it took to start that bad boy. So it looks like we're going to be able to do a little plowing this year. We'll have to see, but it's a bit damp right now. Thanks for watching, uh, guys. Appreciate you watching and subscribing. That's the way we do it. Get your Schumacher, guys. Cost you a little more money, but it's worth it.